I'm Eddie Camden, and now we're going to see one of my students, uh, Lewis Max Smith, who's featured on the website, executing the high rear kick from Thai kickboxing in an actual MMA or mixed martial arts fight. So let's see the reference points in action. Mac is moving forward, uh, gaining uh, distance uh, to execute the kick. The first reference point we're going to see right here, the left leg, is ste he stepped out 45 degrees on the ball, the lead foot for the reference point. As he begins to pivot on that left leg, his body now is rotating in the left direction. As he continues that rotation, there's going to be a vertical lift of the leg to get it from where it was on the floor moving up towards the target. And at the same time, his right shoulder is going in front of his face uh, to protect his head from any incoming attacks. As the leg moves to completion into the full extension hitting the target, we're going to see that the kick now is traveling in a horizontal motion. And at the same time, his left hand is going in front of his face for a reference point to again defend from any incoming attacks. And his right hand's going towards the direction that the kick was coming from. And again, both of these hands are thrown in the opposite direction that the kick is coming from to create more torque. As he finishes the technique, you'll also notice that Mac maintains his balance uh, rather than falling full. It was a perfectly executed tie kick. The opponent goes immediately to the ground, and as he should, uh, the referee, George Grigel, from the Ultimate Fighting Championship, steps in and calls the fight. Now we'll see the kick uh, looped in half speed. And remember that all these details and reference points that are so uh, stressed are so important because they add up to allow you to execute the techniques properly and therefore for the techniques to be effective. Uh, the understanding of the details and reference points will ensure not only that it's a strong offensive technique, but while you're throwing the offensive technique, you're also strong defensively.